there is a difference between high performance productivity where you have very high output, but it's not necessarily weighing a lot on your mind or your body. And the converse, which could be like a horrifically grueling bit of work that is mentally, emotionally, and physically taxing. And there's ways to do those. You can become more effective at work. What I'm trying to say is there's, there are guys out there, very good high performance guys who work big, long days, eight, 10, 12 hour days, perhaps, but they have the right rituals. They're able to maintain peace and presence as they work. It is a skill that needs to be cultivated, but you can still have a high output life without necessarily carrying that stuff. So I think for men in the 21st century, as I was kind of thinking about the frame of this is mastering the art of dropping things at the end of the day, like to calm the mind at night is super, super important for testosterone levels, nervous system balance, and overall health. It's like, what is this ritual at the end of the day that enables you to take all that mental baggage of the day, close the loop, put it down, only to be able to pick it up the next day and, and carry on with the good work that you're doing? That, that's an important practice, I think, core and key. Because if you can't, then you're spending this supposedly restorative time, you know, the six, seven, eight, nine hours that you're sleeping a night that's so regenerative for your body that your body increases testosterone levels during, you're spending that and again in the same nervous system driven mode.